6.30 in the morning and the rain is really coming down. I hope I don't get drenched trying to get to the station this morning. Today we finally leave the EU and enter Belarus. Now I do like border crossings and this one should be a good one, so I'm looking forward to it. And I'll see you when we get into Minsk. Well, I've made it to Minsk, but only just. Uh, a little bit of confusion on the border. Um, a ticket inspector went through the train, was checking passports, visas, etc. And he snapped his finger at me and says, insurance, insurance. And do you think I could find my insurance document? No, could not find it anywhere. Don't know what I've done. I think I left that in my hotel room in Berlin, along with other things like a photocopy of my passport, visas, that sort of stuff. I always like to be prepared. So I've probably left that back in Berlin. So. Uh, he went away and uh, at Gorodna station everyone gets off the train, starts f shuffling their way through a building for formalities, you know, um, immigration, customs, that sort of thing. And I'm thinking, I'm getting away with this. And just then two guys in very Soviet looking caps and uniforms came over and beckoned me to leave the line and go stand in a corner. Uh, a couple of moments later a little lady came over and started talking to me in Russian, which I understood nada. Uh, she then spoke a bit of German and basic German that I know, I, I understood she was telling me I needed an insurance document to get into Belarus, therefore I would have to buy one. And she sold me one for five euros. Now can I just say that is cheaper than the insurance document I bought when I was in the UK. So with insurance document I was able to get through formalities and made it to the train in just with about seven or eight minutes to go. It was a close one. That's why there's no footage at Grodna station. Anyway, I'm here in Minsk. I'm going to show you some sights. It is quite sunny today, even though I'm doing this in the shade, but you'll understand why. It's a glorious day here in Minsk.
Well, that wraps up my full day in Minsk. Tomorrow morning, we're off to Moscow.